we there? Are we there? Here we go. What's up, fam? Friends, fam. Hopefully everyone's doing well. It's a beautiful day. Uh, I'll make this short and sweet. Uh, just to have the idea to uh, go ahead and record a couple of things I had written down back in the day. Probably about pff, over 10 years ago. Uh, maybe even longer than that. Maybe pushing 13 years. I'm old. So, um, the things I wrote, I guess you could call them poems, uh, flows, raps. Um, I was really into uh, rap and hip-hop when I was in Ohio. I moved to Texas and uh, wrote three things. Um, the first thing was my testimony. The second thing was me confronting the devil about how I meant business. Yeah. And the last one was trying to uh, to get other people to, uh, to sign up and uh, to get on board as well more of a motivational uh, thing in the jigger. So, uh, I can start it off here. <clears throat> That's a lovely sound. Yeah, so let me tell you a little bit about where I came from, what all I did, dumb, and then some. It started back in the 08, I was saved at a young age, got stuck on 316 and never turned the page. I was a good kid at heart, or at least I played the part, but all I did was spit it. I never did it. Though what I did at night, I hid, kept under a lid, closed tight, out of sight, going out again tonight, dipping in sin in spite of what I knew it said in black and white. But in my head, I had to try it, and if the price was right, I had to buy it. Then I came to the state where everything's bigger, became all right, a crazy wigger, not knowing what to figure. Started drinking liquor, got sick, drank some more, got sicker. Started doing things I never thought I would do. Crazy drugs, they gave me wings, I hadn't a clue. Then going places where I didn't belong, getting high, staying high all day long. Ha! <laughs> Then going to church and singing the songs if nothing was wrong. But as soon as I was gone, I was back to the ball just like Cheech and Chong. And for real, it's true. And now I'm just trying to be real with you. So take it from me, because I tried that shoe, though it didn't fit. But I had a pride issue that made it hard to quit. So I took another hit just to stay lit. But now I'm here to let you know that the Holy Spirit was a tapping at my door. And when I didn't want to hear it, he happened to hit it some more. Till finally I told the devil, I don't want to ride no more. Inevitable, I cried, and I cried hardcore. And what I felt inside, I never felt before. It was better than any high that I ever felt for sure. And I remember it just like it was yesterday. What a beautiful thing, I know what to say. So I just began to sing. I began to sing and pray. Oh God, you are my high God. And I will ever praise you. Oh God, you are my high God, and I will ever praise you. Oh, I will seek you in the morning, and I will learn to walk in your ways. And step by step, you'll lead me, and I will follow you all of my days. Oh, I will follow you all of my days. I will follow you all of my days. So as you can see, singing is not my strong suit. My sister got those jeans, and thank goodness my wife can sing, so she makes me look good. Um, so that's my testimony. The second one, like I told you, once once you make a decision to follow God, I think it's important to you to... Uh, to be vocal about it. Um, the Bible says, if you're ashamed of me before men, I'll be ashamed of you before my father. And so I, I knew I had to put my foot down and, and let people know that I was serious about following God and that meant saying no to my friends. But this one more so is, uh, is about uh, talking trash to Satan. So hashtag Satan's a punk, right? So I have a little conversation with the, uh, with the devil. Hey, yo, devil. <laughs> I said, devil, who are you? Oh, you don't remember me? <laughs> it's Tim Krause, but now I'm a new creature. About to rock your house, this gospel preacher. Lost soul reacher, I'm a dying to meet you. Designed to defeat you, a no-limit soldier. Let it be known that I told you that I'm ripped and equipped with a new feature. Shooting scriptures like a 9 millimeter from the Old and New Testament. I suggest you rest a minute, because it's about to get right. No doubt about it, and it ain't no stopping me. God's property. 
And we're taking over this land, a holy monopoly. And in case you try to plot with me, ha, better check who I brought with me. That's right, it's the Big JC. And it's on tonight like Dick Tracy. And I'm about to bite because I'm crazy like Patrick Swayze. And nobody plays me for a fool. Cause I'm too cool, so you best back and step up For you get smacked the heck up Believe in you, blue and black from the neck up And believe in me, you won't be getting back up Don't you know I'm a roaring lion Seeking whom I may devour Well you was about to be in the corner crying Cause I got the Holy Ghost power I've come to kill, steal and destroy That which I will fulfill and enjoy And I ain't about to put up with no boy You better hold your split tongue You talking to a soldier, son thinking you're gonna kill me you must be silly you must be retarded it was over before the red sea potter before you even started thinking of getting rid of me timothy aka your number one enemy and i ain't here to stay but i guarantee you're gonna remember me uh, <laughs> so that is me talking trash to the devil and it feels good to call um the devil a punk and talk some trash to him you know, I think it's important to remember, um, you know, we don't underestimate the fact that we do have an enemy, but we should not underestimate the authority God's given us to resist the devil and watch him flee. Um, you know, I, I believe the Bible says when Jesus died on the cross, he said, it is finished. And that was all inclusive. So it includes a lot of things. Um, us having to be under the authority of um sickness and under the authority of our uh, of our flesh and the sin and and, uh, and even uh, having to worry about the devil he's finished all that's finished um, sin's no longer a problem that's finished all we have to do is accept that free gift and so I think it's important to remember that of course it's for fun but we do have authority over the devil so don't be afraid of that punk uh, the last one is me just trying to encourage people to uh, to get off their butts and do something crazy for JC. Get some water for this one. <clears throat> so look out, get ready, cause here I come. I'm about to rattle some, get out the rattle drum. Christ soldiers forever, whatever the endeavor, no matter what the weather, never say never remember what jesus said remember why he bled you gotta stay strong now because it won't be long now you gotta realize that we're fighting a war so fix your eyes on the skies and get ready to soar so get up get out quit being lazy get off your butts and do something crazy for jc the one who saved us the rock of ages and the devil can't phase us because we're armed and dangerous so are you feeling what I'm spilling? Or do I need to be clearer? There's no time for just chilling. The end is getting nearer. So if we're going to be Christ soldiers, we ought to do what he told us and let the potter mold us until we're hotter than soldiers on fire for Jesus. Because believe me, he needs us tonight to enlist in the army of the Lord. Not to fight with a fist, but with a two-edged soul. So get up, get out. Quit being lazy. Get off your butts and do something crazy for JC. The one who saved us, the rock of ages. And the devil can't face us because we're armed and dangerous. So don't play with us, Satan, because we ain't playing. We're tired of waiting, tired of delaying. Listen up, everybody, we're bringing a new flavor. The world's going nutty, and they need a lifesaver. A change of behavior, so do God a favor and use what he gave you. Because if you ain't using it, then use abusing it. But yo, that's your decision, and you the one choosing it. But I don't need your permission, I'm losing it. Ain't no diffusing it. I'm going to let Jesus hear it, make the devil fear it, because I got the Holy Spirit. So here we go. One last time, get ready to blow, it's our time to shine. Get up, get out, quit being lazy, get off your butts and do something crazy for JC. The rock of ages, the one who saved us and the devil can't phase us because we're armed and dangerous. All right, so there you go, y'all. Get off your butts, your hainies if you're not comfortable with butts, um, your rear ends if you're, you know, a really good Christian. Get off your, your rear ends and do something ludicrous for Jesus. Cool? Enjoy.